The number one reason why your website isn't converting visitors into leads is because they don't understand what you do. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to resolve this problem that will result in increasing more leads for your business. Now, there are many factors that come into play with people not understanding what you do when they come onto your website. The one I'm gonna focus on in today's video is how to showcase your software correctly. This is a big issue that I see on a lot of SaaS company websites. What they'll do is they'll take a screenshot of their software and just dump it on their website. And people end up having to squint their eyes and zoom in to try and see what's going on with the software and what exactly it does. And once the visitor is in this mindset, they're probably gonna bounce and you've lost that lead. The way to resolve this problem is to take the key screens of your software UI and redraw them as flat graphics, only representing the key features of the software. So you strip out the non-critical items, simplify all of the data, increase the font sizes, and generally give the UI a bit of a design lift. Now let's take a look at Slack as a great example. So this is the actual Slack software. If you've never seen Slack before, you might feel quite confused and overwhelmed by what's going on here. There's lots of icons, lots of different menu options, lots of different people, lots of emojis and chats and the date, lots of buttons down here. If that was a screenshot on a website, you'd probably feel quite confused. So let's look at the actual Slack website and see what they do. So look at the difference here. If we compare the software that I just showed you and what they're showing on the homepage of their website, it's completely different, although it's still recognizable as the same platform. They've stripped out all of the detail. They've stripped out all of the menu items on the side. They've stripped out all the icons, the search, even the chat box, and they just really simplify it to show the value that this software brings as its main feature, which is people chatting and sharing information together. So if I came onto this website and this was my first impression of Slack, I think, wow, this is really simple, really easy to understand. I can see how this can integrate into my business and really help me. So that will do wonders on the Slack website of people just getting it very quickly and therefore moving on to one of the calls to action where they want to try it for free. Now let's take a look at another example in Trello. So this is what Trello actually looks like. There's lots of text going on, lots of different tags, lots of options up here, search systems. Again, for the first time looking at this, you might be quite confused, quite overwhelmed. You might think, oh, I don't really want to integrate this into my business. It's a bit too much. I don't get it. I'll just stick with what I'm doing at the moment. Whereas if you go onto the Trello website, you can see this is how they've represented their software on their site. You can see they've given the UI a bit of a lift. They've even improved the colors and they've replaced. You can see this is usually where a description of a task would go. They've just changed that to literally be a gray rectangular bar. The same with the tags. They've just changed those to be colorful rectangular bars. They've made all of the images of people look very similar so that you're not kind of drawn to looking at people's faces. And it just looks like a really easy to understand piece of software. So again, as with the Slack website, this will really help people connect with the software, understand what it does and think, yes, I'm interested to learn more, I want to have a trial. Showcasing your software in this way will allow your visitors to quickly grasp exactly what your software does and how it benefits them. This will obviously have a massive impact on lead generation from your website. You're obviously gonna need a talented graphic designer in order to achieve this. So if you would like to receive a quote from us, you can just pop me a message on LinkedIn or via the Rocket SaaS website. If you've enjoyed this tip, please remember to follow me and the Rocket SaaS company page on LinkedIn as we'll be sharing weekly SaaS lead generation tips.